Krisky, but from where where comes the uh, corruption and for what? The uh, bour bourgeoisie corrupts politicians for its own interest. In this case, private education, which generates a lot of money. Yeah, money is it, right? Uh, Krisky, for example, public funding, right? So centralized state takes a lot of tax money in right they put it in one big pool and they say okay we're going to spend this money on educating people centralized education well what happens it's centralized there's only a select few that control that money and those people have connections right or ideologies dogmas so what ends up happening is they make contracts with these corporations some of them their friends and partners and family members and they give them money to create textbooks one of the main problems is textbooks right and the textbooks are poorly written just garbage garbage ideology filled with dogmas that centralized state wants to indoctrinate people with right some of them just so poorly written that have been approved the people who are approving these books they haven't even read the books right in the 1960s richard feynman one of the most renowned physicist in the united states that worked on the manhattan project right one of the best known physicists there are uh it, sort of celebrity in, in the physics world on the level of einstein and um hawkins and stuff like this right but more cool okay he came out he went on the school board in california to approve textbooks for schools and he actually read all the textbooks and some of the textbooks that they were the state was approving he was like he, he read them and no one on the board had read them the only reason that they were approving these textbooks was because the corporations that were writing these textbooks were taking these members on the board that were approving textbooks to trips and giving them money and donations and stuff like this he wrote an article a chapter in a book explaining how bad the education system was and one of the main reason it was so bad was because of the centralization of education due to just on the textbook front right forget about everything else so for example when the ipod came out years ago right in california the school board in california approved a one billion dollar spending i believe it was one billion dollars to buy the first generation garbage ipads not ipods ipads for their schools right just imagine taking all that money and giving it to apple to buy the shit technology so kids could have these technology that's going to be obsolete in like two months three months four months right one billion dollars it was such a disaster that the calf that the school board ended up having to sue apple to get some of their money back because the project was a complete failure right that's one billion dollars that they spent or fucking gave away to a wall street corporation decentralization of education it has to happen okay you want your kids educated don't send them to public schooling that's it